Oh, what is going on guys? This is Joss here and today I am doing something for what I have realized is the first time in this decade and that is going to a neutral rugby league match. I haven't done that since the 2010 grand final. I, I haven't been to a game that I didn't care about since the 2010 grand final. But today, I am breaking that streak by going to West Tigers versus St. George Illawarra Dragons at the SCG. And the reason I'm doing this is because I've been enjoying going to Bulldogs games recently. I've been enjoying going to neutral football games recently. So I figured I'd combine the rugby league aspect that I'm enjoying with the neutral aspect and see if I enjoy this one. Because there's a lot of different kind of teams in the rugby league and I've only ever really got to see them from a Bulldogs away perspective which is fun but I did once love the rugby league a lot and I mean I, I was probably the happiest I ever was when I was just watching rugby league contently like yeah I like Friday night football it makes me happier than anything that that was probably the happiest I ever was so yeah, may, maybe going to some more games will be a happy thing. But yeah, today we're going to see Dragons play the Tigers. And I mean, it's, it's a dead rubber for the Dragons. They can't get the wooden spoon. They can climb a little bit higher on the table. But do they really care? Probably not. But for the Tigers, it's a massive game for them. So I, I think the Dragons' motivation is to stop the Tigers. The Tigers' motivation is obviously to make the eight. And I think seeing either of those things happen would be really, really entertaining. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're heading off to the SCG for my first neutral football footy game in, in nine years. I'm excited for it. Let's go. All right, guys. Yesterday, I made the bold claim that the chicken and cheese at Macca's was by far and away their best burger. Most underrated for sure, but I think also their best. Like the Big Mac's good, but the chicken and cheese is next level. So what I've done is I've made it jar style and I bought two and I stacked them. I mean, yes, I'm, I'm claiming stacking as jar style, but look at that. Look at that, massive. Mm. It somehow tastes better. It's the same ingredients. In fact, it's less because I just ate a bit of bread, but it's the same ingredients, but those five times as good. I'm not sure how that works, but it's amazing. 25 out of 10. Mmm, oh my god, delicious, amazing, neck level, it's like the Sydney FC of burgers. that what a fucking surprise they haven't finished building Allianz yet build quicker fuckheads seriously it's taken a, what, over a year to build it you idiots I could build it quicker in, in Minecraft but still I could build it quicker Pretty glad I wore sunglasses for this one. Just a fucking terrible, terrible seat to be in, but I'm immune to the sun. It's a massive win. It's not a good thing that I've never heard of any of these fucking dragons playing before. I've heard of Wi Fi. Old dogs guy, right? I'm fucked.
crowd is like if Leicester was only made up of disabled people. These fucking clappers. They're killing me, man. They're so loud and annoying. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to fucking neck myself. Oh well, been, been an alright game so far though. Tigers player tripped up the St. George one. They're taking that away. Fuck. They've given it a try at least. Hey, there we go. Not even looking at the trip right now. He looked like he straight up tripped him. Fuck, they're gonna pay it. I thought the Bulldogs atmospheres fucking sucked. It's been amazingly shit, but I mean, nah. nah it's just been alright. The game's been fine. When things have happened, shit's got loud, but overall, shitty atmosphere, shitty ground, empty ground, sun in my eyes. But I don't know. I'll try and look on the at, at the positives. There are none. I don't think I'm ever not drinking, unfortunately. I, I didn't want to spend this money, but this game is too terrible to not spend this money. I'm ashamed, but not really. I finished it before halftime. I think that's a positive.
the fucking cocksucker dragons pat the scrum with two seconds to go. Absolute fucking cunts. Why? Oh, I hope someone breaks a leg in this fucking scrum. Why would you pack it? Just let the game be over. Go for field goal, you dickhead. Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. Come on. Fuck them. Fuck them for packing this scrum. Oh, they don't score. Oh, well. Fuck. Tigers get the win in the end. Massive win. Game at Leichhardt next week is going to be fucking mental. Ladies and gentlemen, fuck, why would, why would I eat? Why? Um, anyway, that was Tigers versus Dragons. I, I did expect a little bit more from that game. I was sitting pretty far away from the, the Tigers supporters section, so it was rather quiet and lacking atmosphere where I was, but... I mean, on the field and off the field, that's that's what you'd expect from a game that's between one team who's got a slim hope of making the finals and another team who's got no hope of making the finals. That's what you'd expect. But the Tigers, I, I wouldn't say that they looked good. I wouldn't say that they're an outside shot for winning the grand final, but... It, it was an entertaining enough performance by them to get them the victory. And I am super, super excited about the game against Cronulla next weekend, which I will be at. Uh, it should be a sellout at Leichhardt Oval, which is pretty hard to do when there's no designated number of attendants because you've got a massive standing area. But I'm hoping that Leichhardt will be bouncing so I can get some good footage and make up for the, the big hole in my heart that the Bulldogs have left by not making the finals. Um... And then, yeah, that, that's it. So, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy all the neutral vlogs. And I do plan on doing some more neutral NRL vlogs. I'm not sure how this one's turned out because I haven't edited it yet. But uh, if you've got any suggestions on what I could do to make them better, I'm not going to, like, support the teams that I go to or anything like that. That's just not me. But if, if you want me to, you know, maybe talk more, talk less, film more, film less, uh, let me know in the comments below because I'm open to suggestions. But I enjoyed going to that game for what it was and I'm excited to go to more neutral games as well as hopefully the Bulldogs final game. I'm planning on going to the Aussie rules before that, but if the Aussie rules is terrible or if... If it ends early, I'll be going to both. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see how that pans out. But, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. I will see you guys next time I make a video. And other than that, see ya. Never gonna stop, never gonna stop. Going to the top, Kobe with the shot. Cooking like a pop, yeah, this shit is hot. Popping like a colonel, I was never tired.